All right, guys, we are here at the storage unit. It's been a while since I did my last video. We have a lot of cards to go through. A ton, a ton of cards to go through. I figured since I had such a big storage unit, started to put some other things in here that I need. This is all cards. Uh, this is basically all cards and memorabilia, uh, except for one box down there. It's tools. And then over here, just a couple things from uh, from my house. But uh, I'm going to use this unit for, for mostly cards, 90% cards, but uh, it's such a huge unit that I have to kind of utilize the space a little bit. But uh, I'm going to grab some of these boxes, bring them home to start sorting through. As you can see, I've been sorting through some cards here. Uh, not the best of lighting, but not too bad. But uh, man, this is a lot of cards. But uh, I need to get through these cards uh, as fast as I can. As fast as I can. I'm on a mission. Uh, I've been searching for collections. Honestly, it's kind of it's kind of dry out there when it comes to collections. I've been really hunting them down, and there there are some out there, but nothing that's like really worth worth uh, grabbing. So. So I think I'm gonna focus on, you know, going through here, seeing what I can find. Uh, this collection has probably been the best collection I've ever got. But uh, let's grab some of these boxes, bring them home, and start digging through. All right, guys, we are back here at the house in the collection room. Been digging through some of the cards, as you can see right here. Got some sorting going on. Pulled out some Fleer metal. Uh, some other cards are mixed up in here as well. Um, got some basketball inserts, some shacks, some Marvel cards, some Topps Chrome, Topps Finest kind of stuff. Got some rookies here, some notable sets that uh, I'm a fan of growing up. And all of these right here, these are all Hall of Famers, uh, all stars, just notable players, a lot of rookies in there. Uh, over here, I got some sorting going on over here. Uh, with some various stuff all mixed in uh, if you come over here once again all basketball inserts got some the USA basketball some notable cards here right there on the top you got the Sam Vincent card with Jordan with the 12 jersey uh, some Marvel DC cards um, some notable sets that I like more Fleer metal all rookies all rookies all rookies Top's Finest over here, um, Electric Diamond, some notable different variations, but guys, absolutely incredible, um, just a lot of sorting, a lot of organizing, uh, so much to do, but I'm glad to be back doing videos, and I'm glad to dig through this collection and show you some of the crazy cards that I find, so let's get into it. All right, guys, here we go. Uh, first off, I want to show you this box that I found at Walmart. I thought it was a really cool value. Um, usually, I go out, I buy top loaders. You know, usually find them in like 25 35 uh, in a package. It costs anywhere from 5 to 10 bucks. But I thought this was a really good deal. I got this for $20. It came with 200 of these card holders. Uh, and uh, comes with this box where you can kind of like store them in. So I'm using the box for now. I might switch it up later, but for now it's pretty cool because I'm just you know throwing everything into these uh, these card holders and putting them right back in here. And then when I'm done using them up, I'll store them out into my collection. But I thought this was a really good deal. I got it at Walmart. Um, you know, 200 uh, of these for 20 bucks, not a bad deal. All right, so let's get into it. So you're going to see a lot of the same player in here because I got this all out of uh, one of the boxes that I went through. Uh, so here we go, kicking it off right here on top. Manny Ramirez, top prospect, 93. We have a rated rookie, Andres Galarraga. We got Chipper Jones. You'll see a lot of Chipper Jones in here. All And these mainly are all rookie cards. Mostly all rookie cards. There might be some others mixed in, but mainly all rookies. Chipper Rookie. Got a couple. There's a pinnacle. Score. Another pinnacle. Upper deck. Uh, this one is a Fleer Ultra. Here's a Manny Ramirez. Top prospects. Upper deck. A-Rod rookie. Fleer Ultra. Got two of those. We got Deion Sanders. Two. Three. Four of him. We got Chip again. Upper deck. 
We got A Rod upper deck. Nice stack out. We got another A Rod upper deck. We got a Barry Bonds 87 tops. Bill Madlock tops all star rookie. Mo Vaughn, the rookies. A Rod score. Got two, three, four, and five of those. We got rated rookie, Don Russ. Greg Maddox, the rookies. Mark McGuire, Fred McGriff, Ruben Sierra, 86 Dunruss, Andres Galarraga, Jose Canseco, some more chip. Like I said, I was, there's going to be a lot of them in here. I found a Topps Gold. I think of this one or the other one. I think this one, actually. I'm not sure. I found a Topps Gold. I have it somewhere. I think I might have put it in an actual top loader. I don't know what the value is on it. Ah, uh, here we go. Chipper Jones. Some more. Oh, uh, we got another one underneath there. Pinnacle. There's a Deion Sanders. Another Sanders. We got three of those. Fred McGriff. Greg Maddox. McGuire. Chip. Buster Posey. That was a random one in there. Mark McGuire. There's a Top Prospects Upper Deck Chip. Bernie Williams, Manny Ramirez, classic best. Chip, this one's pretty cool. The rainbow edges. Rated rookie. Then Griffey tops all-star rookie. They got Fleer, Griffey. Manny Ramirez with the rainbow border. There's another Manny. And then last little stack in here, Ruben Sierra. Jose Canseco, Galarraga, Chip, and uh, two Bo Jackson Raider rookies. So, guys, this all came pretty much from one box. Uh, and there's more. There's more. I haven't fully gone through everything from that box and was able to uh, to put uh, into these uh, these little sleeves yet. But uh, yeah, that's pretty crazy. A ton, a ton of rookies. Lots of Hall of Famers. Like some of them are grade grade worthy. I'm gonna have to look up some of these to see um, what's the value of them graded in a, a you know nine or a ten. Uh, but these are all in really really good shape. Um, some better than others, but definitely some of them will be worth grading. All right, let me get into something that's really cool. Like I said, I found a lot of rookies in here. I found a lot of basketball rookies. So I'm gonna show you. Uh, I decided to put all these basketball rookies into a binder by player of what I found over the past couple of days. So let me show you that. All right, guys, here we go. Kicking it off right here. And these are all rookies, just rookies. I put everything into this binder that I had lying around to keep it all organized. Um, and then from there, I'm able to see what I'm going to do with it. All right, so kicking it off here, we got Jason Kidd. And this is back in front. Jason Kidd, all rookies. Some in his uh, NBA uniforms, some in his college uniform. Next, we have Stackhouse. All rookies. Look at this. Just rookies on... Ro this man, when, when, when I'm able to fill a page with the same card and it's a rookie of a player, I love the way it looks. I absolutely like... When I see this... It makes me feel complete. We got some more here. All Stackhouse rookies. Some in his college uniform. Then over here we're getting into Rashid Wallace. Just rookies for days. We got Jamal Mashburn. And these I found literally in stacks all together. We got Vin Baker. Let's imagine it's like I'm just like going through them like one, one rookie after another, after another, after another, and then move on to the next player. Got Allen Houston. Tons of 
tons and tons of Allen Houston. We got Marcus Camby. Glenn Robinson. Ray Allen. Damon Stoudemire. A lot of Damon Stoudemires, as you can see. Got Isaiah Ryder. Some in his college uniform. Then we have uh, Penny Hardaway. I found a ton of these Penny Hardaway cards. Like a lot of them. I don't know if they're uh, they're worth anything. Um, they are. I'll tell you what set they're from. They are from uh, the Classic Collectors Club members only. So I, I have I have not looked it up yet. Might not be worth anything, but I have a ton of them. Right here we got Eddie Jones. Got Mitch Richmond. So nice to see it all together, you know? Uh, Chris Weber. Just look how nice this looks. Just it looks, you know, like, you know, when you're at this, uh, uh, you know, at, at in these years and you're like, oh man, I really wish I had a Gary Payton rookie, you know, and then boom, that now like, you know, 30 years later, look at this. Like, insane, insane. Like, very grateful. Here we got Mookie Blaylock, all rookies. I think we might have a lot of these. We got Dravin Petrovich, Glenn Rice, Mutombo, Nick Van Exel. Got a lot of those. Jalen Rose. Derek Fisher, Jermaine O'Neal, look at that, it looks good, a lot of Jermaine O'Neal, we have Kerry Kittles, I remember being a big Kerry Kittles fan when I was growing up because uh, he played when I was living in New Jersey as a kid, Antoine Walker, Sam Cassell, and that's it. And then I got some uh, some newer cards that I bought at Walmart in the back there. But uh, but guys, just rookies on rookies on rookies on rookies. These are all rookies, and this is not all of them. I have stacks that I have put off to the side that I have to go by player by player. So there's more that I have to add to these players, and there's other players that I have to add to the binder. So I got other binders to do it because obviously this binder is starting to get full. But uh, but yeah, I have a ton more rookies to add to this, ton more players to add to this. All right, let me get into some more cards. All right, here we go. These were really cool to find. My first time ever finding these cards in a collection i believe i don't i don't believe i found any of these ever before from this set 1952 bowman like guys the colors on these like some of them have like imperfections but the colors are ridiculous 1952 bowman's like absolutely ridiculous cards in great condition some a little bit better than others, but I am blown away by the color of these cards. The fact that they've maintained, look at that. The fact that they've maintained such good color on the front end after so many years, what has it been like almost 80 years, like is absolutely ridiculous. So cool to find these. 
you know, it's like a piece of history, guys. So it's like 48, 22, 58, 68. So yeah, about 70 years. Jeez. Just like, hold, look at this. Like, absolutely incredible, guys. Like, I think that most of these are commons. And hopefully I find some more of these in the collection. But just to find these is bonkers. Absolutely bonkers. Yeah, I just wanted to share these ones with you guys. Let me spread them out here so you can get them, see them all together. Just like a piece of history, you know? Or a piece of history. Absolutely incredible. 1952 Bowman's guys. Look at the colors on them. Absolutely incredible. Super excited to find these. Add these to my collection because I'm going to hold on to these ones. Uh, yeah. Let's hope to find some more. All right. Let's keep digging. All right, guys. Check this out. A 1983 Darth vader card and i looked up the value it's not like super 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 valuable but to me this is absolutely awesome to find in a collection like you know digging through all these sports cards you know it's really cool to find these marvel cards and like these different non-sports cards in there but i did not expect to find a 1983 darth vader i haven't found any more of star wars in there um but this is a pretty first, a good first one to find. There it is, a 1983 Darth Vader. Absolutely incredible. All right, here we have a 1990 draft first round Emmett Smith. Underneath there, we have a Topps Super Rookie Deion Sanders. We have, this is great, this is a Basketball Rookies Tony Gonzalez. The tight end for the Kansas City Chiefs. Underneath there, we have a pro set prospect number one pick, Barry Sanders, in his Oklahoma State uniform. We have a super rookie, Michael Irvin. We have Giants running back, Joe Morrison. We got Mr. Steve Young. Great shot in this, this card. Right here, we have 1965 batting leaders, Tony Oliva, Carl Yastrzemski, and Vic Davalillo. Very nice. Yastrzemski right there. Underneath there, we have a million dollar moments, Kobe Bryant. This is from his second year. Always good to find Kobe. And now we're getting into what I wanted to showcase here at the end. Now, all of these right here are all Derek Jeter. Like, I've, I came across a ton of Jeter, um, all different kinds of Jeters. I'm probably going to, I feel like I'm going to come across a ton more. Um, but absolutely ridiculous amount of Derek Jeter cards I came through. Like, here we go. We got a Bowman. This is a... 1993 Bowman Jeter right here on top. Underneath there, we have a uh, 1993 Upper Deck Tops Prospect Jeter. We have a 1992 Four Sport Draft Pick Collection Jeter. I think we have two of those. And we have a 1994 Future Foundation Jeter. Two of those. Right here we have, let's see what year this is. Um, it is 1995. 1995 Rookie Class Jeter. We have a 1996 Pinnacle Hardball Heroes, Derek Jeter. Right here we have the 1994 Prospects, Derek Jeter. 
right here we have the uh, 1994 classic best gold cheater we have the Fleer metal universe what year is this one this one is a uh, 1999 MLPD we have a couple of these ones right here top prospects Derek Jeter this is from tell you right now 1994 top prospects Jeter we got one of those we got two, we got three, we got four, and we got five being a electric diamond. Uh, Got to do a little bit of research on that. Don't know the, the value yet, but electric diamond's a little bit more rare. Then right here, we have a select certified edition 1995. Uh, Derek Cheater, very nice card. We have a caught on the fly Fleer Metal Universe Derek Jeter. And last but not least, we got not one but two of the 1992 Tops draft pick Derek Jeter rookie cards. So guys, absolutely incredible. I have so much more to show you guys. The amount of vintage that I found, just it's out of control. I got to get it all together, sorted um, to uh, to be able to show you guys. But absolutely happy to be back doing videos again. Going to get more on a regular schedule with them. Just been crazy hectic. You know how the holidays are. It's absolutely ridiculous. So many things to do, so little time. But guys, look at this. Jeter, 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 Jeter. Absolutely incredible. Mixed in with some Kobe, Irvin, Yastrzemski, Tony Gonzalez, Barry Sanders. Come on. Let's go, baby. All right, guys. There you go. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Smash that like button. It really helps new people be able to see the videos and see the channel. People who would love to, uh, to see people hunt down collections, to see what they find, and to inspire them to go out and hunt collections themselves. So thank you guys for watching again. Feels good to be back. Hope you guys enjoyed all of these Derek Jeter cards and those 1952 Bowmans and all those rookies from earlier basketball. Thank you guys for watching again, and I will catch you in the next one. Take care.